back. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. I'm Daniela. And I'm Lily. And this week's theme is Jesus Calls His Disciples. Join us as we journey through the rainforest experience. If you haven't figured it out yet, all the songs are on this little green card, so make sure to check that out after this. Let's say the invocation. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Now let's say the morning prayer. I thank you, my Heavenly Father, through Jesus Christ, your dear Son, that you have kept me this night from all harm and danger. And I pray that you would keep me this day also from sin and every evil, that all my doings in life may please you. For into your hands I commend myself, my body and soul and all things. Let your holy angel be with me, that the evil foe may have no power over me. Amen. Amen. Here we go. At Rainforest Exhorts, Jesus leads the way to the very best treasure of all. Sometimes it can feel like we are all alone and have to figure out everything by ourselves. We don't feel like Jesus is with us, but he is, and he leads the way. God is always with us, pointing us in the direction we should go. Let's say the take-home point together. Rainforest Explorers, Jesus is with me. Jesus is with me. Jesus leads the way. Um, we're going to listen to the Bible story from God's Holy Word. It comes from the New Testament book of Matthew. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe not. <laughs> I was on the right one. <laughs> While we were walking by the Sea of Galilee, he saw two brothers, Simon, who was called Peter, and Andrew, his brother, casting a net into the sea, for they were fishermen. And he said to them, Follow me, and I will make you fishers of men. Immediately they left their nets and followed him. And going from uh, going on from there, he saw two other brothers, James the son of Zebedee and John his brother, in the boat with Zebedee their father, mending their nets, and he called them. Immediately they left their boat and their fathers and followed him. As Jesus passed on from there, he saw a man called Matthew sitting at a tax booth, and he said to him, Follow me. And he rose and followed him. And Jesus reclined at the table in the house. Behold, many tax collectors and sinners came and were kind with Jesus and his disciples. And when the Pharisees saw this, they said to the disciples, Why does your teacher eat with the tax collectors and the sinners? But when he heard it, he said, Those who are well have no need of a physician. But those who are sick, go and learn what this means. I desire mercy, not sacrifice, for I came not to call the righteous, but the sinners. Thanks, Daniela. Now let's watch the Truth Up video. Hi, I'm Megan. And I'm Nick. And welcome to Truth Up, where we seek truth in God's word and in God's world. Hey, where were you earlier? You were going to meet at the park. I told you I couldn't come. Did you still go to the park? I did. I was there all by myself. It was very lonely. Well, I'm sorry I couldn't be there with you, but you weren't alone. Really? Really. Who was with me? I didn't see anyone else there. Just because you can't see him doesn't mean he's not there. Well, who was it? It was God. God was with you, and he is with you all the time. Really? No matter where I go? Anywhere in the world, God is with you. What if I went into outer space? Even there, God is always with us all the time. Wow, that's amazing that God will never leave us. It sure is. It's time for the Rainforest Fact of the Day. Did you know that a howler monkey in the rainforest can make a call that is louder than a military jet? Whoa, that's a loud call but not as strong of a call as the one Jesus had for his disciples. Jesus called them all to a specific role in his ministry. And even after he was gone, Jesus was still with them. That's right, because God is always with us. Join us later when we make a compass. See ya. Bye. I wonder what Nick and Megan are going to make. I wonder how Nick and Megan are going to make a compass. Let's say the take home point. Rainforest explorers, Jesus is with me. Jesus is with me. Jesus leads the way. Woo. Um, now we say the echo prayer. 
Jesus, Jesus, you promised to show us the way. You promised to show us the way. Help me follow you. Help me follow you. Wherever you lead. Wherever you lead. I know you are always with me. I know you are always with me. In your name we pray. In your name we pray. Amen. Amen. All right, now let's check out what was in your BBS kit this week. So for crafts, you're going to be making this. So you will have gotten green, <laughs> green construction paper and orange construction paper. And you will trace your feet and write your name on one. And then on the other one, you're going to write follows Jesus. And then you're going to glue them to the green construction paper and cut grass strips on the side so it looks like you're walking in the grass. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Thanks. No problem. All right, and then for snack this week, we have some goldfish because Jesus called his disciples while they were fishy. Some pretzels to remind you of the nets that were being fixed. And the Capri Sun to remind you of the water. All right. Um, make sure to check out our friends, Mr. Steinbuck and Mrs. Hawk, for the game and the Bible story for this week. See you at closing. Bye. Bye.